Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls and children of all ages, welcome everyone to this installment of the AXS Puppy Stream. As always, you're listening to the dulcet tones of myself, Sock7, and your host, AXS Puppies. And now, welcome, back welcome. to the game. It says fly around the spires, but I don't see any actual like indicators as to where to fly. Oh. You have to fly to, like, there'll be, like, instead of the yellow, like, point on the map, you have to fly to the white one, and then it'll be, like, an arrow. Lumos. Oh, okay. Oh, God, that's, like, 800 meters away. I thought it was the school spires. No. <laughs> okay. Also found a new broom you can buy at the train station. I feel like my rating for this game will be dropping again because I learned something today that there is no consequence whatsoever for using any of the curses, let alone the really? killing curse. Mm hmm. It said the most you'll get is an NPC just grumbling that you used it, just a killing curse. Yeah. Oh, this is just popping balloons. This isn't even actually like flying around yeah. the spires. Yeah, it's popping That's balloons. That's dumb. That's dumb. Okay. Alan's beard. Rebellion. Lumos. This is really giving me the feels of fucking Assassin's Creed. Yeah. His tomb. Likely, I need to go further. One thing I'm not really sure about is you, why Rebellion. can't I do anything Lumos. with the items I have chosen not to give people back for their quests? Hold on, Jane. Uh, Hogwarts. I'm a wizard with a curly fry hat. No. I am a wizard. Lumos. No, my name is Puth Puthy Lickahus. Yeah, right there. Every time my person talks, it comes up. Anyways, what were you saying, Shane? Um. Hmm. Ah, I don't understand why all the items I've chosen to keep, being the evil bitch that I am, are just still in my inventory. Like I can't do anything with them. I can't even sell them. Cause like that's what I would do is I would sell them. these pants. Are awful. God. This, this the, way you shouldn't be an evil uh, asshole. I have a feeling I'm not alone here. Like the top hangs down over my ass and clips through it so it looks like my ass is like a fucked up Batman symbol Lumos. because my cloak is currently fucked up over the top of it like an ape from now I do at least appreciate the, um, the spells in this game when you learn to cast them. The motion you make is the right motion. Mm -hmm. At least it was Guardian of the Ocean. Exactly right. I imagine the rest of them are right. Because like, the motions are described in the book. Lumos. Revelio. Do 
include your audio. Rebellion. Thought I did. Yep. Okay. I'm on my way to divinations class. Under what? Divinations class. What is that? Like learning the future, basically. Oh. I don't even have that assigned or that class yet. No, it's the Yugon Ladies Moms class. I'm just doing all the like quests to unlock new spells. Uh, if I could power it somehow. This class sucks. Who would want to climb a ladder to their class? doing potions class earlier and the blind kid standing there in the front of the class looking intently. I'm not sure at what. But he was very focused on whatever he was looking at. Tomb. <laughs> What's that hanging there? I believe I'm That's heading there next because I have nothing else to really do. It's actually pretty massive. That's nice. I'm here with an empty inventory. Good to know. Down I go. No other way. It's sealed shut from the other side. Down this hole. Jump fucking down the hole. Oh, there's water. I only have one school assignment left for Professor Garlic. Mm. I need to get all the combat nice. plants, though. It costs lots of things. Yeah, I went around and bought all the seeds I can find, but I don't know where the other shops are at to get the rest of them, like for Mandrake. There's a. Um, so if you look at the Hogsmeade map, I can't remember. But there's a shop called like Death and Nuts or something. Death and Nuts. Something oh, like that. Oh, Dogweed and Death and Nuts. That's a shop where you buy that shit. I'll just go there right now. Yeah, I went all around the town to every, or all around the world. All the different little towns and stuff. Just looked at all the shops and I was like, yeah, I have no idea where this is at. 
Yeah, I came to the shop during my first trip here where you went to lunch. There was no one here. Now there's someone here. Uh, sure. Make sure I got the best clothing equipped. Good. That one's not, but I don't really understand why I can't make this one. That one's good. Mm. I can buy all of this. So I know exactly what I'm going to do in the room of requirements. Uh. I'm just going to put a whole bunch of those uh, gardening tables down and just make everything. And now that I have the seeds for them, never really need to worry about buying things again. Hey, there's a person over here I haven't talked to yet. Old Gok said the helmet was in her sarcophagus. The dead Ashwinder. Your compatriots must have made off with the helmet. Found the Ashwinder. Like this. Oh, nice. Oh, I got the quest to follow the butterflies. I really got the achievement for that earlier today. Mm, I know there's a mechanism to open this door. Oh god, that's right, this person's voice. Jesus mm. Christ. Serona, or whatever? Yes. Yeah. The dogs came in here and, like, knocked all the window up. Jesus, it's all muddy, all wet. Lodcock, the sarcophagus has been raided. They found no helmet, only a dead Ashwinder. Damn, they got here first. We need to get it before Rookwood uses it to further ingratiate himself to Ranrock. 
I saw one of their campsites not far from here, but I fear you must go in alone. My fighting days are behind me. I'll head there now. Good. There's no time to lose. Skip the all the dialogue with this woman so to listen to her talk. Our chance at any leverage, no matter how small, with Ranrock. To think those wretched thieves have their hands on such a relic. I was at the Hog's Head Inn earlier. I really enjoyed it because the Hog's Head like moves and shit. This place has seen better days. Slots are full. Um, I figured out how to your ancient matter uh magic meter capacity. Figured out how to increase it. Oh nice. Is it by doing the ancient magic events around the world? Yeah, the like little unicorn horn looking things. Okay. I saw those, I just didn't do any of them. Pretty tough. You're going to regret that. 
Is it not possible we could, you know, jog to the tomb? No. Oh, we gotta do the slowest walk possible. So now can we walk. Not a bright child. Shall we finish what we start? Hope you could hide from me, did ya? What are you folks on? Ah, this town. I was up here earlier and got the flu. Troll? Hi everyone. Alright, uh, okay. I think this area must be big if I have to actually hold a button to load into it. Where? This tomb? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Where the hell did this butterfly go? Before. I retrieved the helmet from the Ashwinders. Well done! This is sure to impress Ranrock. The helmet shines even more brightly than I imagined. The etchings, the contour of the profile, remarkable. It looks stunning, Lord Gok. I see why you wanted it back. You did the thieves a service by recovering it. I know many a goblin who would have killed for it. 
Huh, then I'm glad to be rid of it myself. Thank you. This should earn Ranrock's trust. I will take it to him immediately. It may distract him from his search. His search? It, uh, it is merely an inkling. You have impressed me greatly. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls and children of all ages, thank you for joining us on this installment of the XS Puppy stream. As always, I have been your commentator, Sock7. She has been your host, EXS Puppies. You can follow her at youtube.com forward slash EXS Puppies and twitch.tv forward slash EXS Puppies. And as always, you can follow me at onlyfans.com forward slash Sock7. And we will see you next time. Take care. Take care.